Hello, my name is Ben and I'm going to demonstrate a program called Tidy Files. Tidy Files will relocate any file into a unique folder well into unique folders so that you can easily find the files you're looking for. Now Windows operating systems allow you to index a small percentage of files to speed up the search. Now if you index all of your files or the majority of the files that you believe you'll need it will take a long time to find exactly what you're looking for. Instead this program will allow you to find files by categorizing your files by extension and then categorizing it by name. It's powerful and very easy to use. So what I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a demonstration. I've actually got a TIFF folder already set up for you so let's just navigate to that folder now. So it's in C drive. No, 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 not C drive. Desktop. And go down to my stuff. Okay. Okay. Now all these files here. PDF file. MP3 file. FLV file. Now if you're not too sure what that is, it stands it's basically a video file. Uh, another PDF. A GIF file, which is an image file, a text file, another video file, executable file here, a zip file here, and WMA, and some MP3 files. So as you can see, there's a uh, basically a variety of images, a uh, variety of files. Okay, and what this program does, it will categorize them into folders. Okay, so let's start off with step two how would you like your files tidy okay we're going to firstly do this one then we're going to do this one this one okay now if you click here it says when you click on file it says if you select this one the following folders will be created okay there's actually that's the big list there okay and what the computer will do, what the program will do, is basically look for all these files and put them into the relevant folder. For example, 7 then is a type of archive file, so we'll go into here. And um, so on and so on. Let's see it at work. All you gotta do is just press tidy up. There you go. Okay. Now, if you click on archives, there you go, you see archive files. If you click on document, you see document files. If you click on ebooks, you see ebook files. If you click on executables, you see it's um, sorry, still loading. There we go. Try again. There we go. Executables. Um, because they end with ESC, EXE and MP3 videos FLV and MP M M4V okay so it's done there okay it's, it has actually left out a few images okay um, that will be fixed a few files that will be fixed in the uh, when you purchase the program okay so but in the meantime I can just put it here in this demonstration We should get some of them or most of them. There you go. That, that's better than before. Okay, and those images went to there. Okay, when when let's move on to the next step. Let's sort file based on names. Okay, so we look at which one has the most file type or which ones you want to categorize. Now, it would probably be that you would want to categorize this one. Okay, so all you got to do is just type in the name. So I want to categorize all blackjack files, all files that contain the word blackjack. I also want to categorize all files that contain MySQL. 
and jQuery. So basically in this this part here we'll create a file, no sorry, create those folders, we'll look for the relevant files and put it into the folder. Let's do that now. As you can see it's still processing. There we go. Voila. Okay, so there you have it. Uh you click on blank jack. Actually yeah, I call it black, but it still found it. If I if I had made it blackjack, then I would have created a folder called blackjack. Yeah, it's just a little mistake I made. Anyhow. Uh jQuery, yeah, the folder file went there. Yep. Okay. So imagine just going to let's just um let's just go to my stuff now, shall we? That is what it look, looks like. Okay. That is what it looks like uh, when we click on ebox, not into folders, MySQL, and so on and so on. Very nice program. Quick, easy, and very powerful. Okay. So that basically uh, ends this demo. Oh, the other thing also is um, before I go is that you can also launch files from here. So when you load up executable executable uh, launchable files. Come on, Peter. Here we go. Uh, right click, click on launch. If you want to delete a file, click on delete. If for some reason um, that file didn't get transferred, which it will, um, but sometimes they're always gonna. They're, sometimes there's gonna be some uh, files left behind. Not many. Okay. So all you gotta do is this, these are images. So just uh, you can also drag and drop images there. Yeah. So that's Ajax loader. So we drop it here. Ajax loader. There we go. That's the end of the demo. Thank you very much. Bye bye.